My name is Nicola Hassan from Project Management Jülich in Germany. And uh, yeah, I will try to explain what the Food System Partnership is. And in fact, the full name is uh, Sustainable Food Systems for People, Planet and Climate. And it's a co-funded partnership under the cluster six. So there's a call open uh, with a deadline for mid of April. And um, so what will be the content of the partnership? Actually, there is a strategic research and innovation agenda that has been prepared by the SCAR. Um, and it has four thematic areas. So it's uh, changed the way we eat, changed the way we produce and process food, changed the way we connect, and changed the way we govern. So these are the thematic areas. And then there are four activity areas. One is uh, the funding of research and innovation. One is the observatory, that means uh, monitoring how the food system is transforming. Uh, one is the knowledge hub with living labs. So this is really more on the local and regional level. Um, and the fourth area or activity area is um, knowledge sharing and knowledge scaling, which also involves science to policy interfaces. Well, the new thing about the partnership is that we want to have funding bodies, but also research performing organizations. So everybody is invited to join. And in fact, um, well, there has been a survey that everybody should fill in um, by SCAR and the Food System CSA. The Food System CSA is a project that supports the Food System Partnership. Um, so these are good contact points and there is um, the proposal phase is open so the consortium is forming so now is a good time point to join but of course it will be possible to join at any time so with an amendment you can become a full partner to the partnership or you can also be an associated partner um, so there's many options how to participate in the partnership and um, so I already said the deadline is mid of April for the proposal but the partnership is supposed to start uh, by end of the year.